Hi, I'm Nolan DeCumin. Join me in my quest to find invasive species. In this video, we will explore invasive species, which are species that come from another geographical location and are disruptive to native species. A common problem we have on Greenfield Ranch is wild pigs. All that you see around you here, all these clumps of dirt, it's all from wild pigs. What they do is they come in, usually at night time, and they're hungry. And they come in and they get underneath these roots and they burrow underneath the grass, and they're looking for grubs and things to eat. So they put their snouts right in here, and they just kind of go like this, and they root around until they find a little grub and they eat it. But it's extremely damaging to the grass, as you can see. Everything here is uprooted, and it's going to be a long time for this grass to recover. The interesting thing about feral pigs is that they are so tough. They are very durable. Uh, they are able to adapt very easily to conditions you throw their way. They are able to breed with the wild boar, which was introduced to the United States at the beginning of the 20th century. The largest pig on record was named Hogzilla, and it was shot in the United States in 2004 in Georgia and it weighed over a thousand pounds and was said to be over 12 feet long and its tusks were measured to be about two feet long. My mission is simple. I will cross the width of the ranch looking to film invasive species. You may wonder how invasive species arrive in new locations. Species are often brought along accidentally with humans. Human expansion is mostly to blame. Species such as pigs were introduced as game for early settlers. Smaller animals, like Norwegian rats, travel by hitching rides with boats. Once they arrive, they attempt to take over the land of other animals. We asked Miss Pearson her take. How would you get rid of invasive species that are already established? I think once they're already established, the only way is to eradicate. Um, the number one method that seems to be accepted is to actually um, practice prevention. Can you name some of the most damaging invasive species? Number one, in my opinion, is the yellow star thistle because it gives me a lot of flat tires when I ride my bike. So the star thistle was introduced in the 1800s and it was imported with alfalfa and it's infected 10 million acres and it chokes out native plants and it also causes fatal chewing disease in horses. The other really important one is sudden oak death, which is a fungus and it actually has killed thousands of native oak trees and it's a huge point of research right now in terms for um, universities trying to solve the problem. It was first observed in 1995, and it's found in 14 of our counties in California, and it's really threatening the risk of all native oaks, and it's actually started to infect nursery oaks. I saw a pig here, and I chased it from this road. It was a black pig, and I chased it from this road. It ran right alongside the road. It didn't even run away. It just ran right alongside the road. And it ran from back there, all the way here, all the way through here, and into the forest, around this turn. And then it just took off into the place. And that's the last thing I saw. And that was earlier this year, probably about three or four months ago. 